Every day, thousands of people expand their digital existence by creating a Twitter account. But, in a matter of days, they've abandoned their account to leave only tumbleweeds floating down their feed. You know the type. In fact, you're probably one of them. They see some TV show using Twitter, or some celebrity in a magazine talking about their Twitter feed, and they decide to give it a go. The trouble is, they don't understand what to do. With little to say, no followers to engage with, or no answer to the question, what's happening, they never return. We sent Rhys Malt on a mission to find out why these people leave and to see what keeps others coming back. You can add your voice to the conversation by tweeting and adding the hashtag, tweetmyworld. As an experienced and regular Twitter user, I've spent a lot of time reading and posting tweets, but I must admit, it wasn't all roses and chocolates from the start. I didn't get it at first either. I was one of the lucky ones. I had a mentor to guide me through the process. Many unfortunates are not so lucky, and they have many and varied reasons for leaving. I just don't have the time. Too many tweets about what people had for breakfast. And the reason they simple, I started tweeting about pimples. I stopped living for moments and started living for people. Often other networks are more developed now and easier to use. I found it a bit distracting. Call me a Twitter quitter. These Twitter quitters, as some like to call themselves, are missing out on all the things that Twitter has to offer. Because I only use Twitter. These people continue to use Twitter for a variety of different reasons. Different industries are being positively impacted in many different ways. So a lot of large companies like Coca-Cola and McDonald's, even Tim Hortons, are monitoring the Twitter sphere so that they can gauge and evaluate how the customers are reacting to their products. It broadens your mind to be on social network. Television shows, newspapers, government organizations of all levels are incorporating Twitter into their media channels providing even more ways for people to interact over Twitter. Taking the lead from our program, of course, many television shows are incorporating Twitter into the viewer experience. Twitter themselves recently announced on their blog a strategic partnership with TV show The X Factor USA, enabling the audience to cast votes. In Australia, ABC TV Q&A garner thousands of tweets every episode and display them on the screen moments after being published. These new media interactions, where people are influencing the outcome of programs via Twitter, are certainly one of the reasons many people are joining or returning to the platform. The chance to interact with celebrities, even have the celebrities themselves returning, although sometimes a little sheepishly. So with so many reasons to return, and some great examples of celebrities who have given Twitter a second chance, taking another bite at the cherry is an increasing possibility for many. If you have quit in the past, and are now thinking of a return attempt, here are a few people that you can consider following to improve your chances of staying this time. Remember though, communication is a two-way street, and you will get much more out of your next experience if you engage as well as listen are monitoring the Twitter sphere so that they can gauge and evaluate how the customers are reacting to their products.
because I only use Twitter. I can't be bothered with Facebook because it's too inefficient. I think it broadens your mind to be on social networks.